Two years ago, Al Baxt and Peter Whitcup designed Tuttle's Restaurant with an eye toward saving as much money on electricity as possible. They're just beginning to realize how far ahead of their time they really were. They installed special low-voltage non-vacuum bulbs made in California, which run off a 12-volt transformer. They cost $5 each and are guaranteed for 50 years. Three special panels of dimmers and air conditioning controls were built in. Maximum use is made of foam rubber because of its insulating qualities. Two years ago, co-owner Al Batsk was all for saving money, but was skeptical about the predictions of energy crisis. It takes uh, constant training. Uh, meetings with your uh, department heads as well as your uh, right down to your bus boys. Uh, energy is something that I think we've all really become much more aware of than we ever did before within the past few months. Some contractors showed resistance to the high-priced energy saving design demands. Special low-temperature heat circulating ovens were installed in the kitchen. They use less energy but will keep a roast in a perfectly rare state for 24 hours. The coolers have spring-loaded doors so no one can accidentally leave them open. Bax says setting a good example is essential. If he were wasteful about energy, it would be very difficult to make his workers conserve. The increased cost of installing the special equipment at Tuttle's ran the cost of building the restaurant thousands of dollars higher than conventional methods. But in the long run, Bats is sure the savings will be great. He believes he saved about $20,000 in electricity during the first year of operation. He says in three to five years, the energy saving systems will have paid for themselves. In the meantime, Bax has become an energy saving fanatic himself. All this without ever inconveniencing his customers or his employees. Bob Lawrence, Channel 4 News.